Hello and welcome to you know, Let's Play. Me, a move six of Vampire. On the last Let's Play, we found Father's Watch, and watch and healed a bunch of people. Let's just make sure we get most of the peeps. Oh, there's that guy who's got a cold. Uh, everybody sanitized there, sanitized. They're stable here. They were sick, but now they are healing. And let's go there. I fucking hate how this game did that. Slash I. It's been a long time since I've played this game. Can I put more uh, light? There we go. It's amazing how... Oh, uh, I guess I could do this. Sora, I need to get. I need to go north. Oh, I can't find. At where uh, north is. Can't I do one? Oh, that's blood. I thought that was health, because you know red's almost always health. Rocks. Okay, I was going the wrong way. I thought I was going north. Even though there's a compass right there. Eh, <sighs> bugger today. Today was just me, you know, emailing my boss about, you know, uh, computer stuff and. What was the other thing? Oh, hey, how you do? I might as well do that and then eat some rats. <clears throat> I have this thirst for blood. Do you really have to say that every single time? It'd be nice if it kind of did the uh, Far Cry 3? Yeah, 3. Thing where he's just... Where at first he's doing that, but then later he's just like, Yeah, not great, but yeah, I'm used to it. Uh, but yeah, I'm tired because like just demon bosses, about stuff, and more jewels, and then um, my dad keeps bugging me about shit, and I'm just like, Dad, could you please just give it a rest? I got things to do. Things. Granted, it was about um, what is it? COVID stuff, but it's like, I. Really... Can you go back there? Oh yeah, I think you can't do that till later. All that's done, all that's done, all that's done. Yeah, I could just drop. Do you know you just can't be like, hey, where is this person? Or relatively, where is this person? <clears throat> Anyways, it's very much a th thing where I'm just like, hey, I'm busy. You're... You have all that time on your hands. How about you get a hobby instead of bugging me to get a COVID vaccine while I'm trying to do my work. I said easy does it, boys. We can deal with this, Vermin. Burn it, boys! All of you I always hate in games... Maybe not so much this, but in other ones where, like Sekiro, where guys can turn on a dime so often. And then I'm just standing here being like, hey, I press jump, and it takes one entire fucking second for that to take into effect. So, I don't know. Like, when you see this big motherfucker and they're doing this big they're already into their swing and they're like oh we can turn on a dime to change that attack You're mine. do you really want to do this eh. oh hey diagra to you okay <clears throat> Is there a thing right there? There is a thing right there. Uh-oh. Okay, he was shaking a bit, so I was like, mm, 
Don't want to try that. Yeah, let's go this way. Okay, so who are we looking for here, anyways? Who is he? I have no memory of him. Guy with hat. He also looks kind of like that guy with hat. This guy does look like a guy with a hat. Mr. Bane. Since I... Well, seen... Infecting you is probably the last thing. Whoa. How... The way this... Have you heard... Not really. A man such as yourself, knee-deep in the muck of Whitechapel, must know more. Speak now. Heard it closed after the owners died. Refugees don't want to come to Whitechapel no more. Scared, are you? You sound disappointed. As long as she was there at the dispensary, it attracted more immigrants and kept my place full. Such a shame. Why am I... Maybe it's because you lack faith? Okay. <clears throat> Goodbye. That was a real bugger. Also, let's get rid of that uh, marker. Where is it? You know, all those markers all the way up there. Is that just going to be there forever? Okay, I could just do that. But yeah, I got my first COVID shot. Pfizer. It was a bit of a pain. Because... They're asking for insurance. Which you do have insurance, it's just I got it like half a week ago. Granted it, you know, back orders or whatever. So, it, like, I don't have the cards, but I have the insurance. And they couldn't find me in the system, I guess. So, is there any specific way? I, I think that's his house, but I have to go through that way. But I asked people about stuff. <clears throat> I'm going to try and save his life. And the reason for that is because while he's a cunt that probably deserves to die, granted, I guess he does, when his will thing happens, he gives resources to the poor. Because everyone gets healed when they, uh... Oh, hey. Stupid new ball. They call me stupid new ball, but I just killed you easily. Now, granted, if I had to wait for my power, it would be a different thing. <coughs> but, uh, yeah, if I let him... <clears throat> if I let him die, then, um, you know, he dies and the health of the community goes down. It is kind of funny that if you kill the serial killer, then the health of the community dies. You know, the guy with the necklace who I, I don't know, didn't condemn. Because apparently condemning makes him tell you more stuff. It's amazing that some blood powers take blood, but then the ultimates don't. I guess we kill you first. Unless there's anything... Oh. Oh, hey. Hello. Quinine. So it went down that way, so let's go this way first. Yep. Oh, heck. Oh, shit!
Uh-oh. Boy, that was a real cunt. <coughs> Sorry for the uh, sore throat. I don't hate the Kobe agent. That seems to go that way. Rubbing myself up against the walls. There should be a thing in games like this where you could where it tells you which one's not the main path. Oh fantastic. Hey, have I been here before? Couldn't have, because then I'd run into the, uh, one guy. It's locked. I feel like I've been through here before, where I had to kill a bunch of guys here and then unlock a thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Then why didn't I run into the uh, other guy? I guess I might have been drunk. Or tired. Or both. Though that door might have been locked. It probably was. Anyways, um, what was I saying? COVID. Well, ooh, ooh, wolves. Who are you? Do these things exist? I would have to suspect that trying to have an infrastructure project like this would probably be quite costly. How the fuck do I get over there? Maybe I do need to go over there. It's amazing that this game is one of the games that I was up there, right? Yeah. Is one of the games that I don't have a ton of videos of. Because I remember playing this game to death and having 20 Let's Plays. And right now I'm down to three. Which one? How do I get up there? Okay. All right, I've definitely been here before. <clears throat> I can't believe I'm doing this. I guess we should take that way since it's an up way. There we go. You know, because I just can't knock on his house and be like, hey, dude, um, I mean, to give you immortality, the thing you join this club and all that stuff, um, for? Also, it's weird that these vampires don't have 
the immortal like tons of cash and stuff. Influence that can, you know, go away with time, but cash? I mean, they don't need to eat. Doctor, what are you? Well, I was. Why do I don't? Goodbye. So I basically went through all that just to come out this side. Main quest? Anyone? Enter the mansion. But where is the mansion? With all these buildings built together, it's kind of hard to see which one's the thing. There isn't a big here's where he lives thing. Maybe there's a way to select it. I cannot enter. I think it might have been a bit more north. Because I remember something that it could be on the north side. Oh, right. Okay, how about some of this? <clears throat> okay. Yeah, really. Okay. Oh, that ain't good. <coughs> Damn it. Need a cup of tea for that. Cycle or circle? Okay, but how about if I disappear? Where is it? Oh, oh, wait. Good thing I didn't do that during the folding screen monkeys thing. Insecto, whoa. How do you get that type of gas mask? <clears throat> Fuck you guys. Okay, so is this the mansion? It looks housey. Multi. Uh, 
<sighs> Tea feels good. Dawson's mansion. Here I am at last. But the question remains. Am I ready to make a dying man? Well, at the very least, it won't stop, um... Okay. Oh, he's on the ground level? Okay, we're gonna just go through all shit. Wait, what is that? Are those hamburgers? Just has a table full of hamburgers. Oh, this is a nice fucking mansion. I have to admit. Is he upstairs? Okay, he's not. Reduced in rank for falsely accusing a man of murder. I wonder what Inspector Albright thinks about his punishment. Like, was he falsely fault? Like, did he make shit up, or what? Hey, if I'm gonna make you my progeny, I need to acquire assets. It's locked. It's locked. Scrooge McDuck. Yellow. Here we got time. Finally, you're here, Dr. Reed. What took you so long? Communism. I several of your barricades and outposts to access your mansion, sir. Death, pestilence surround us, and time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, blood transfusion equipment available. All this could be so useful in a hospital. Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. Most thoughtful. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself would help me to escape the Reaper. Very well. But before I proceed, I have a few questions for you. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. So for doing First all this hard quest. I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed. Planned very carefully. I'm the only vampire here. So I'm going to end your life. Do you not wish to discuss the procedure for even a minute? I don't have a minute to indulge in idle chatter. I can't feel my legs and the cold, so cold. Well, we do have questions. I will become your maker. I will. Do you understand what that means? Well, I certainly won't consider you my liege or some such drivel. You can be assured of that. So you're definitely a cunt. You'll need to feed on warm blood. Blood from mortals. Wait, does it have to be warm? How do you feel about that? I'm rich, Dr. Reed, and powerful. I'm sure I'll be able to acquire all the blood I need without ever having to sully my own hands. I mean, I guess you can pay for blood. What do you know about the Guard of Prewood? 
What I do know is that I'll crush anyone or anything that would dare to oppose me. Let's move on, then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my life waning with every moment. But first, before you embrace immortality, what would you do with <clears> such <throat> a gift? That's a rather impertinent question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer me all the same. What will your first action be as an immortal? To save London. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. Boy, they're really being like, hey, um, fuck this dude kind of thing. Who gave you the right to decide the fate of thousands of people? My money. My money and my pending immortality gives me the needed authority, Doctor. I'm a businessman. I'm used to tough decisions. You really plan to build a quarantine wall across London? Yes. It will be tall and strong, separating the wheat from the chaff. By doing so, you will also create two separate prisons. Come, sir. An eminent doctor like yourself knows that such radical measures have proved efficient in the past. Let me guess. You mean to isolate the rich from the poor? This is a desperate measure for desperate times. England must prevail, Doctor, no matter the cost. He doesn't say no. Isn't there more yeah. stuff? Okay. Quarantine is not a bad idea, medically speaking. But I'm convinced this epidemic will not be contained by mere walls. As long as the right people are on the right side of the wall, that's all that matters. <sighs> But you can't guarantee infection will not spread. Just one contagious carrier would be enough to create an apocalypse. The apocalypse is already knocking at the gate. We must be strong now. What if a new outbreak happens inside your walls? You'll have created a giant trap. That won't happen. As long as we dispose of anyone that is contaminated as soon as they are spotted. I mean, I'm going to save him mainly because if he dies, then the health of the neighborhood goes down. I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. At last. All right, do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. I've been preparing such a long time for this. Boy, look at that V-Sync. <laughs> I will kill you. Are you ready for immortality, <clears throat> Mr. Dawson? Fuck you, but Drink hey, now. you make and say farewell to life things better. As you prepare to be reborn. What do you mean, drink? What about the blood transfusion? I'm the doctor and the vampire here, so I'll give the orders. Why did I get Drink, a syringe? Sir. Now. All right. Good. That's enough. That's enough, I said. Oh, that's a scalpel. I will not die. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, no. You will die, sir. Steal yourself. You're already in death. Can I loot through your pockets while you're temporarily dead? It's locked. Yeah. I I actually was curious because like I was uh before we finish this because I looked up why you shouldn't tilt somebody's head back if they have a nosebleed. It's like because the uh Stuff will go down into your stomach and you might vomit it up. And apparently, like, you can have small amounts of blood, but if a human drinks blood, then, um... 
It can be very poisonous because there's lots of iron and blood and having tons of iron is not good for you. Anyways, that's going to be the end of this. Let's play so comment. Guys, I like comments. Don't you like, dislike, to subscribe. If you like my YouTube and likes it, grow. Then please like, subscribe, and check out the rest of it, grow. And please remember to be a new ammo to help control the pet population. And until next time, let's be me, Emil6 of Vampire. I'm going to go check work emails. See ya.